It's Friday morning and many citizens have decided that the weekend has already started. They sit and drink coffee, enjoying the autumn sun. Going with the flow of strollers in the pedestrian zone, we're back at the French Mediatheque. Ina Puan is the cultural attaché and the vice director of the French Institute. A great strength of the French Institute is the fact that it's embedded in the city, in the everyday life of the citizens. It's present on the entire cultural scene of Zagreb. In fact, another cultural event is about to happen. This time, it's not painting, but music. In a couple of days, we'll have a concert of three French singers who represent the new generation. It's called French Kiss Tour No. 2. The club scene in Zagreb is lively and changeable. Many clubs open and close within a year or less. Some clubs have managed to retain a strong presence. One of them is here. The Tsibona Tower stands like a gate to the west of the city. Under the complex, there's Shambhala. With its distinctive oriental style inspired by a famous Moroccan club, Shambhala is a favourite of the night crowd. David Gurgin takes care of public relations. We have guests of all ages here, from the 20s to the 50s and older. We have visiting DJs on Fridays and local DJs on Saturdays. But the crowd tonight is atypical. They all love French chanson and this is a treat for them. French Kiss Tour takes young female talents on a European tour. This time it's the turn of three girls with guitars. At the sound check, we meet Elodie Freger. Déjà, j'ai gagné une émission de télé-réalité, donc les gens m'ont connu. I was the winner of a television reality show, so people saw me as a celebrity before they knew that I was actually a musician. I'd say my music is more sensual, while Katal's music is more violent and passionate. while Constance's music is very soft, like an invitation. True to Elodie's description, Katal appeared in red, the colour of passion. I'm not telling stories, but speaking in images. It's a bit complicated, I guess, but I still love to sing abroad. Constance Amio is a romantic among them. What I play is very folk because there's a lot of guitar. We're staying in the city centre. I adore the small streets, small houses, it's very charming. Zagreb may be charming, but tonight it was charmed by these young ambassadors of French culture. <laughs> 